This video is part of our Parallels Tech Byte series. In this video, we'll take a look at running graphics intensive applications on a remote machine running in Microsoft Azure and managed by Parallels RAS. This is the Parallels RAS web client, and from here, we'll launch a GPU and power desktop. With the desktop now running, let's quickly switch to the Parallels RAS console. Here we can see the user session is active and we're able to get insights into telemetry details such as latency, quality and protocol details. Switching back to the user session, we confirm that the remote GPU is in place. In this case, we use a full NVIDIA A10 GPU and we're leveraging the UDP protocol. Let's now launch the first workload. This is an OpenGL application. We'll open up the application, set the particle density to maximum and run it. And as you can see, we're also able to interact with it by hovering our mouse over the particles. We can also do the same thing with four OpenGL applications running at the same time. These are four different browsers running in the same session and we're able to interact with all of them. In this case, we are really pushing the GPU to a maximum of about 97%. The next workload is Google's SketchUp. We open up a sample and we're able to interact with it. Rotate the angle and zoom in and zoom out. Next, we'll test the same GPU and power desktop and this time leveraging two different displays. Note that the session is now stretched over two different monitors, one of them being an ultra-wide screen. Again, we'll launch the OpenGL application and we're now able to drag that to the other screen. Opening up another OpenGL application and dragging that to the primary display, we're now running two different applications on these two different monitors. And finally, let's look at a couple of gaming scenarios. For example, here we are playing Fortnite on a remote machine, leveraging about 20% of the GPU with a great experience. And lastly, here's Microsoft Flight Simulator. This concludes this video on running graphics intensive applications on a remote machine managed by Parallels RAS. For more content, subscribe to our channel and browse to the Parallels Tech Byte series.